the darker the subject matter, sometimes the easier it is to find the comedy because it feels like a, a sort of pressure valve. The climate it came out in in 1963 was the Cuban Missile Crisis, the Soviet Union, two enemies staring at each other. You know, all that time's elapsed and yet here we are again with, uh, you know, war in Eastern Europe and, and nuclear weapons being uh, mentioned again. In really dark places, you find humour and it sort of saves your life. It gives us that chance to take that material and add to it this awareness of what's going on today. The collective live laugh is one of the most amazing things in the world for me. A whole collection of people will be triggered to yes. laugh at exactly the same time. And their singular and individual enjoyment of something is actually added to collectively. We go, let's, let's laugh at this. And then, then somehow we've sort of got mastery over it. It's not going to destroy us. After the last, you know, three, four, five years of lockdowns and, you know, theatres closing and cinemas, closing, just, just to get a lot of people in a room to share a funny, dynamic, entertaining, thoughtful experience together yeah. is, is a good thing. So we want to send people home um, laughing and afraid. So they're having a breakdown. <laughs> Desperately weeping and yes. yet laughing manically. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>